Hello and welcome to an overview of the Attune portal. I'm going to walk you through a few things you should know to get started with your first policy. Let's start by taking a look at the account screen. This is a landing page you'll come to each time you log in. The insured accounts that you've already created will appear on the left of the screen. Choosing one will give you the details of that account and the products you've quoted or issued for it. It's kind of like navigating your emails in Outlook. Always keep in mind that if you get stuck or have a question, you can refer to our support tab in the left navigation, or you can chat live with a representative from our customer care team by choosing the chat icon in the lower right of your screen. Now let's create a new quote. Start by choosing new account in the top left of the screen. We need to enter some basic information about the business, including its name, mailing address, and classification. From this, we'll indicate if that type of business is likely to be eligible for each of our products. For this example, you can see that the type of business I'm creating is eligible for BOP, including excess liability, and workers' compensation. I'll choose Get a Quote and start into a new BOP quote. The first section of the quote process summarizes the underwriting guidelines for this class of business. You should also review our complete underwriting guidelines by visiting the support page and downloading the latest set of guidelines. Once you have confirmed the eligibility, you can choose the checkbox and continue. Next, you will enter some policy level information, including the location address, which is defaulted from the mailing address. For businesses with multiple locations, you can add each address here. After clicking the Next button, we'll run a set of pre-fill services that collect additional information about that business and the addresses you entered. We sometimes determine a business is ineligible at this point for restrictions like hours of operation or the crime score of a location. If you have questions about eligibility, you can always contact your sales representative to learn more. For each location, we only need the number of employees and desired AOP deductible. If the pre-fill services find information about the building, we'll pre-fill that on the next screen. Keep in mind if our data is inaccurate, you're expected to update it. For this case, I'll correct the building square footage and enter the building limit at $0 since the insured is leasing the space. From here forward, you only need to select coverages that you would like to include on this quote. Keep in mind some coverages are specific to the location and class of business. With the coverages selected, submit your quote and play our quote game while you wait for it to complete. Once your quote is ready, you can immediately download the quote letter to review the complete details and even download the inputs you entered as a PDF to save to your AMS or use for a signature to confirm the details with your insured. Choose the Edit button to create a new version of the quote to try additional coverage combinations or a different deductible. You can also rename this quote or archive it to keep better track of the versions that you want to consider. To issue a quote, simply choose Continue to Bind and complete the contact information of your insured. The email address is where the invoices will be delivered to. While you will automatically be included on all invoices, you can add an additional email address in case you want to include someone like your agency's billing department. Finally, select a billing plan and choose the Bind button. That's it. You've just issued your first policy and you can download the PDF to share with your client immediately. 
Thanks for watching and happy quoting.